God has created everything in the world for a specific purpose. There is also a purpose behind your and the rest of humanity's existence. God reveals this purpose in the Quran. He who created death and life to test which of you is best in action. He is the Almighty, the Ever Forgiving. A person will leave behind everything he possesses in this world, including his own body, and move on to the hereafter. That body will be placed into the ground where it will decay. The home or car he was attached to with such meaningless passion will also decay. Just like all other people, however, he will appear all alone in the sight of God to be questioned. However, despite this apparent reality, engrossed with everyday routines, the majority of people totally forget the truth of death and the hereafter. They assume their life to be confined to this world only. This error made by some people is revealed thus by God in the Quran. They say, there is nothing but our existence in the world. We die and we live, and nothing destroys us except for time. They have no knowledge of that. They are only conjecturing. God has made clear the limits to observe and the behavior with which he is pleased or displeased. Accordingly, a person's conduct in this world determines his rewards or punishment in the hereafter. Therefore, every single passing moment brings us closer to either heaven or hell. All those you see around you, your friends, relatives, basically everyone living on this planet, will certainly one day die, as did billions of others who lived before them. To forget this truth marks a great thoughtlessness. Man, who is incapable of avoiding death, will most certainly die, for one reason or another, at a time and place unknown to him. Death is the beginning of one's real and eternal life. This is a life determined according to how one conducts himself in this world, and it is unlikely to be changed once death comes upon him. Death is a gate to bliss and salvation, if that person has spent his life to earn God's good pleasure. For those who turned away from God, however, it is the beginning of eternal torment. That being the case, never forget to strive to the utmost of your strength to attain the hereafter, before the moment of your death. Live every day as if it were your last, as it may possibly be.